Okay, well, The Force was not with some Star Wars fans at an AMC theater in Burbank on opening night. Nope. We started! We started! Oh my gosh. Angry moviegoers demanded the theater replay that movie because the first 20 minutes of The Last Jedi they saw last night had no sound. Yeah, the theater either chose not to restart the movie or was unable to. So irate fans began streaming out to the lobby, screaming and yelling. It got so heated, Burbank police were called to keep the peace. The theater offered fans full refunds. Well, things went a lot smoother at other showings. Many wore costumes to the new Star Wars flick. A woman had her high heels custom made. There were rave reviews for The Last Jedi, by the way. Some fans even got emotional. It's, I cried more in this movie than any Star Wars movie ever before. It's very touching, and it goes all different directions that you didn't think was going to happen. Did you cry? They almost got me, but not quite. I'm too tough. <laughs> I did an ugly cry. He was in there crying? Oh, yeah, definitely. I could, they were between us, and I could hear him. This, by the way, was the late Carrie Fisher's last performance as Princess Leia. And there was a surprise for her fans last night. This little guy, Fisher's dog Gary, attended a sc the screening dressed in a costume. He sat on the lap of Fisher's assistant. And he was, yeah, he was, whenever she came on, he looked up and his ears perked up, you could tell. Yeah. Did you like it? High five? High five? Good boy. He is a sweetie, isn't he? I love that well, her assistant is still taking care of the dog. Yeah. yeah. It's really terrific. Quite a legendary Hollywood family. Yeah.